My uh, memories was when Dad was sheriff and we lived in jail. And uh, uh, we, uh, uh, Dad said there were five of us youngsters at the time. I was the oldest. I had uh, uh, four brothers then and then the baby came afterwards. But um, Dad set us down and he said, now I want you kids to understand if somebody breaks out of the cell block, they're not going to come up through the living quarters and come up to the bedrooms to get you kids. They're going to take right off for the high road and get out of town. Well, I think it was ideal growing up in Big Rapids. Uh, uh, fond memories. I was born in 36. Uh, January 1, 36. I was the first baby in Macosta County at that time. Uh, winter of 35 and 36 was of hard winter. I have seen pictures of the snow from that era and the snow, they had no equipment to move the snow and the snow was as high as the power poles are. The logging by that time, by you know, by the 30s and the 40s, the logging right in the, in the when I remember when I was growing up, was mostly, uh, mostly the time was spent was because of uh, World War II. And so the, most of the activities at, at our time was recycling. Uh, I remember as a youngster, uh, uh, you know, collecting paper, collecting rubber, collecting anything for the war effort. The largest change would be in, uh, in Ferris. It was Ferris Institute when I started there. And I went to school in wooden army barracks. There were army barracks at one time. The change in Ferris as I came back was just, from, I just can't believe how it has grown. And Perry Street, of course, also. But uh, no, I, the way I remember uh, growing up, it, it was hard times. We didn't have electricity uh, where we lived. And uh, we didn't get electricity, I think, till about 1945, after the war, just after the war. And, uh, and uh, it was, uh, and we farmed with horses, and we didn't get a uh, tractor till just after the war, too, so.